go for a ride and take a look at some homes in the neighborhood. How does that sound? Sounds good, Terry. All right, Michelle, now that I showed you uh, the foreclosure, what a foreclosure looks like, let's go look at some homes that you, you might be able to afford. Yes, please. <laughs> All right, we're now in another neighborhood called Boca Square. This, uh, this neighborhood was built, again, 50s, 60s. Um, modest price homes starting in the two range. Coming up to tops off right now about 400. And it's a really nice community. It's made up of about 1,500 homes. You're in walking distance to the elementary school, which is a wonderful school. Uh, and again, you're, you're east of I-95. You're about a mile from the beach. You've got sidewalks. Uh, really a fabulous community to live in. Yeah, it looks really nice. You said it was a good school district too? Oh, absolutely. Okay. And At some point I'd like to have kids, you know. <laughs> <laughs> I wasn't kidding. Well, I told you I wasn't kidding. We were real close to the school. Uh, here we are at the school. It is close. Okay, Michelle, we're, we've popped into another neighborhood. This is old Floresta. We've got some historic houses. This is, um, again, Addison Meisner built back in the 20s. And you've got really a different style of homes. You've got homes that look like Addison Meisner's that are rebuilds. And then you have some real historic ones. Um, but this is the historic district of uh, Boca Raton that was established back in the 20s. And some really neat houses, wouldn't you say? Yeah, they look really old, but nice still. Yeah, a lot of them have been restored and you know, here's something um, more cottagey looking with obviously something more modern attached to it. Thanks Terry for the tour. You're welcome. See you back at the office. <laughs>